Hey guys, what is up? It's Bricks only here today, and um, in this video, t uh, today I have a big haul, like a really, really huge fall haul, a total of four items in this haul, and to get it over, or to get it started, I should say, uh, just to get this thing out of the way, I did receive this in the mail today. This is the new fall 2018 Lego catalog. Um, I normally don't share when I get these, but I figured may as well, because it technically is still from Lego. Now, which one's smaller, which one's smaller? Okay, so I guess I'm going to work my way from smallest to biggest. This is a parcel from Lego Directly. I ordered this thing a long time ago, and I don't even really remember what's inside. Not even lying. Okay, so I'm going to open this up. Should be easy. Should. Yes, I normally don't have really good luck with those. Okay, so inside, we got some Lego parts. Okay, yeah, now I remember what's in here. Mm, definitely not just because it's inside of me, um, or because it's in front of me, but, uh, if you can see, we've got a ton of random pieces. Now, because I can, I'm just going to dump them out right in front of us. So first off, we got this awesome bag, I love these bags, but that's not really the main reason I ordered this. Uh, this is just a bunch of really miscellaneous parts. As you can see, we've got a lot of dishes here. These are for some railroad crossings that I want to upgrade, and a train signal that I want to upgrade, and then these parts, along with some other bricks and poles and stuff like that, are for uh, train signals. This is just something that I was missing for one of my sea cans, and there was a door on it, and I didn't really like the doors. Same with this thing, and then also some yellow tiles to go on that sea can with the yellow one. Uh, also, these crosses are for upgrading the um, the red crossings, and then um, I did get one of these plants because I don't really have many of these. But in one of my other packages, I will be getting more of these. Hint, hint. You guys might know what it is. It's not preferred bricklink, so that probably makes it easier. But yeah, just a really a bunch of miscellaneous pieces. Now, after doing the horrible job of putting all of those parts back inside of the um, bag they came in, I've got another haul. This one is one that I have been waiting for for a long time, and um, probably a couple, at least a couple of you guys have been waiting for too. This is the last haul for my special project. This is the last package right here, the one that I've been waiting for, the one that I've been waiting to make that video on, and then I can reveal the special project. This is the haul. So I'm just going to open it. Um, because I think we build the hype up uh, enough. Now, I did get a new knife, or I didn't get a new knife, it was the one that I already had, because if you didn't watch my last video, um, my other knife failed me. Uh, so, this one doesn't seem to be really doing a better job. Maybe I'll open it from this end. Come on, really? This is also a weird package to open. I think that might have done the trick, though. Mm. There, that 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 works. Oh, I love when sellers do this. There. Now, if I'm not mistaken, that should be all that is in there. But as you can see in these resealed bags, like actual Lego bags, when I love when sellers do that, it's a very good way to um, help, I guess, save the environment. Uh, using their heat sealers, this is really cool. And, um, yeah, these are all parts. Whoa, huge light flicker. That was sketchy. Anyways, um, I guess I'm gonna angle you guys down a bit more so we can open these up. I'm still gonna, oh, maybe I don't even need to use my knife. Woohoo! Okay, so in these, and of course I have to give you a hint, I mean, these are pretty obvious what they're for. They're for the couplers on train, but, because that's too easy of a hint, I'll give you guys another hint just because I feel generous. That is these. All, however many of these are, there are eight, I believe. Should be eight, at least. Uh, these are for railings for the train I am working on, because you guys already know it's a train. And I have actually already built the special project. I tried to do time-lapse, but LEGO Digital Designer sucked for building on. Would not recommend it. The instructions were all over. I had pieces floating in midair, and then more pieces floating in midair, so it was just a really bad experience. Had a big headache. But, um, yeah, I'll be, these are for railings on them, 
That was really besides the fact that whole rant, mini rant. And then to get to the seller's minium, minimum, minimum, to get to the seller's minimum buy, I have this one Lego flower stock fee piece that does not like having the camera focus on it. So, that's too bad. Um, but I guess we can live. So yeah, that's all from that package. Now, I'm going to attempt to fit this on screen. This is a box from Lego, and this is not going to work. So I'm going to also attempt to angle this down. And that should... That, that, that'll be, that won't be too bad. So okay, I'm going to open this big old box up. If I can, which hopefully I can. There's one side. There's two sides. And now if we just do... Whoa, light flicker again. One big slice down the middle. That should do it. So I'm going to close up that knife before I stab myself. And inside here... <sighs> we've got a bunch of stuff. Now I'm going to quickly move that out of the way. Because, um... That's kind of in the way, and, um, I mean, the lights, kind of blocking the lights that I have, but I guess we can take out all the bubble wrap, which there's lots of. Good job packing this, whoever packed this. Ouch. Oh, that, that, that's too bad. Okay, well, I guess the first thing, main big thing, kind of upside down there, is this Lego City set. This is set number 60. 205. Uh, this is the new train track pack for 2018. Uh, much better than the old one because, you know, you get, I mean, the same eight uh, straight tracks, but they only give you eight flex, or, um, yeah, eight flexible tracks. So that's only two train track worth of flexible track. And, you know, it's still, because some people need flexible tracks, so I, th I think it's a good idea to just have, like, like, a little bit. But then they also give you um, a whole stack of curve track, too. So, I think this is what every Lego fan or every Lego train fan has been needing, and it's really great because, I mean, some people still might want flexible tracks, so it's a good way to get it. But besides that, oh, come on, now it's stuck to the tape. Uh, what's this? Oh, we got another sticker. I only currently have one of the blue ones. I thought they were done with these. Okay, that's cool. We also got some minifigure slash mini Lego characters, I'm just going to call that. So we got two of the Harry Potter ones. Um, I'm definitely going to get more of these in the future, but for now, I just got two. Um, just to see what I get out here. And because I collect every minifigure from the minifigure series, from now on at least, I did get one of the Unikitty series. I personally feel like this isn't too bad of a series, but it's whatever. And then we also, way over here, is the plants made from plants um, promotional set. See what I mean? I was going to be getting more of those. But, um, this is really cool. I will be doing a review on this just because I'm really curious to see what's inside. So, um, yeah, stay tuned for that. So, yeah, guys, that concludes today's haul. Um, it was a pretty big one, but not quite as costly as my last one, which I will have linking up there. That is when I got the Palace Cinema. But, um, yeah, now I'll be able to finish my, uh, Lego train special project that I'm working on. And, um, because of those pieces, and then I'll be able to do some other updates around the city. Plus, I got that... Oh, I forgot to include that set. Okay, there. <laughs> Plus, I'll get some more plants around the tree, city, finish the train yard, get some minifigures, and look through the catalog. So, we're going to have a really good time here with these. Um, again, stay tuned for some videos that will be coming up with some of these sets and uh, parts. But, yeah, guys. Um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. It was quite big. Quite lengthy, but um, yeah. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one.